buena gente, sean bienvenidos, yo soy su amigo Vir y el día de hoy les voy a presentar un capítulo donde Amber va a ser quien nos enseñe a volar en las alas. Sí, nos han dado una misión especial con eh, Amber, secundaria, donde podemos trabajar o convivir con ella como personaje del juego secundario. ¿ya? También parece ser que Kaya tiene una misión, imagino que los demás personajes seguirán la misma ruta. Para ganarnos amistad o ganar algo referente a ellos Así que chicos, espero les guste el video Vamos a verlo y pues aquí les dejo a Amber Enseñándonos a volar Vamos al video Hey Traveler, I've been looking for you everywhere How's that wind glider I gave you last time? <laughs> Seems like it's really growing on you But then again, you don't have a, gl a gliding license. <sighs> Isn't it obvious? You gotta have a gliding license to... L oh, but we've been gliding for ages. Yeah, you've been gliding all over the place. <laughs> so you came looking for us because you want to give... No way! The Knights of Avonius have strict rules. You need to pass an exam, and only then will the Knights... It Today, I'm here as an examiner to oversee your official glide. I gave you your wing glider, so this is my responsibility. At least that's what acting Grandmaster Jean would... Say. An exam? <sighs> what a pain in the butt! Then again... I'm sure you'll glide through it. I mean, the whole city saw how well you flew the day that Storm Terror attacked, so I'm sure you'll have... But... We do need to respect... Here, take this gliding manual. No need to... For example, only one person per wing glider. No carrying anything over the set weight limit. No taking off using an animal slime, and so on and so forth. Anyway, be sure to read it, okay? Wow, that's a big old book! Great, come find me when you're done. I'll be at Windrise. <sighs> the Knights of Favonius gliding... When the first wisp of wind brushed across the land, birds that yearned for the sky had wings, but no way to fly. They asked the animal god, how can we reach the heavens? To which the animal god replied, you have yet to find that which is most important. As the god spoke, the wind thrust the seeds of a dandelion high into the sky. The birds thrust out their wings, but the breeze was all too mild, leaving them to stumble across the earth. So they went to the gorge, where the wind showed off its wild and incomparable strength. They threw themselves off the cliff and flapped their wings amongst the howling winds until they were able to fly freely in the sky. To the animal god they went to gleefully say, We understand now. All we needed was a stronger wind to fly. In reply, the animal god said, What you lacked was not wind, but courage. It is courage that has allowed you to become the first flying birds of this world. That's a cool story, but is the knight's gliding manual really written? Huh. Great, you're here. Did you have a good read through of the gliding manual? Got all the rules down? Sounds like it was a real dr- Ugh, the gliding manual is super dry. I couldn't get into it at all. <gasps> really? Hmm, Paimon thought there were some pretty cool stories. Oh, you must mean the example case. Some of them I like. My favorite one is about the illegal animal slime takeoff. Apparently, if you pop an animal slime and take off in the burst of wind, it shoots you up really, really high. I ri No, not that story. Paimon meant the one with the little bird who wanted to learn to fly. Uh, what? Let me take a look. Oh, shoot. This is the storybook I used... Oops, sorry. I put both books in the same pile and must have grabbed... How in the heck do you confuse a bedtime story? Uh, it's because maybe deep down inside, that fairy tale is... What you lacked was not wind. It's courage that's allowed you to be... Reading that gave me the courage to glide, to become an outrider, and to become the gliding champion of Mondstadt. Uh, but anyway, don't be nervous. Just glide like you're... You okay, then. You just need to follow the marked route to the...
But it's no surprise, given the way you handle your glider in a storm. The next part of the exam is in Mondstadt. See you there. Don't keep me waiting. Alrighty then. You heard her. Back to the city. Let's not keep her waiting. Hey, here. Over here. I'm all set up. Let's carry on with the same deal as before. Glide through the markers and get to the finish without stopping in the middle. Anything that nice to do for you. Ne Easy! You've flown this way before anyway! Once you've passed this final stage, you'll finally be able to get your... Just keep thinking about that license. Done. Vale, y luego, vaya. Windborn Traveler, you are required to land at once by the order of the Knights of Favonius. I am Otto of the Knights of Favonius. Okay. Otto. What? What's going on? Please, show me your gliding license. It is against the law to glide without a license. I am arresting you under Section 7, Article 12 of the Mondstadt Penal Code. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say will forever carry on the wind. Wait, I'm an instructor. This is a gliding exam. Oh, I see. Okay. Well, you picked a bad time to hold your gliding exam. Really? Why? The Knights of Favonius received a report from a sister at the cathedral, claiming she saw Raptor gliding around these parts. I thought your student here must have been his partner in crime. Raptor? Who's that? A known criminal in Mondstadt. He always uses a wind glider to commit his crimes, so people started calling him... Wow, he flies fast then. Hmm. So far, we haven't managed to catch him. Our plan this time was to draw him into the cathedral with a precious artifact. But he escaped with the artifact. Fortunately, okay. one of the sisters put some secret markings on the artifact using Ella. But he was too fast, and we couldn't even keep up with the. Well, if you need help chasing down a gliding criminal, I'm the one for the job. So tell me, which way? As far as I know, he was last seen near Springvale. Oh, Clara. But that was some time ago. Leave it to me. With us chasing him down together, he doesn't stand a chance. <laughs> Once we've got this raptor guy, we'll pick up where we left off. But no need to worry. I'll be sure to have a word with Jean. Vale. Misión completa. Y ahora vamos por eh, ave rapaz, ¿no? Nueva misión. This is Springvale. There must be some clues about raptor around here. Mm, vale. The sister from the cathedral put some secret animal markings on. Use your elemental sight and keep your eyes peeled for clues. Okay, ¿cómo se usaba eso? Okay. Ooh, hey, what do you think this is? It looks like a broken tree branch. Oh, Paimon knows. It's from a frame of a wind glider. Therefore. There are no elemental traces on it. Oh, it looks like it's just a plain old tree branch. Hmm. How do we know if this was left by a strange bird or an animal slime? Animal slimes are airborne creatures. They don't leave marks on the ground unless someone stumped on one to take off. Hmm. How do we know if this was left by a raptor or an animal? Hmm. A 
strip of cloth with animal markings on it. <gasps> Una chica. Ah, está. Sanguin. Ok, ¿qué hace Shanling aquí? Looking at the design and the way it's woven, there's a good chance it came from a wing glider. Wow, outriders have to be textile experts now? It's a harder job than Paimon thought. If this really belongs to Raptor, it must mean his wind glider is broken. It appears that the elemental markings point this way. Huh. Well, do you think he ran off ahead? There's only one way to find out. Come on, we should keep following hmm. the markings. Ooh, what's that? Looks like something's going on up ahead. It sounds like there's a battle going on. Could that be Raptor? Quick, let's keep going. I know, perdimos un poquito gente, porque... Viene ligado, no sé cómo se las actividades con otra que no era la que. Someone needs assistance. Thank goodness, the Knights of Favonius have arrived. The Hilly Chills won't dare pursue me any longer. What happened? I can't believe it, but the Hilly Churls attacked our car. Hilly Churls? But I thought the Knights of Favonius had cleared out most of the Hilly Churl camps around these parts. It's a small camp not too far from the village. The route I take on my delivery runs ensures I steer clear of it. But today, well, some crazy fellow suddenly fell out of the sky and landed right in the camp. Hmm, now. Oh, it really riled them up. They chased the funny-looking fellow as he fled, which brought them out in the open. I managed to get away, but they smashed my fruit carts to smithereens. Oh, I... Funny-looking? In what way? Oh, he was holding on to something. Must have been heavy, because he couldn't glide in a straight line to save his life. Maybe... Honestly, people like that shouldn't be allowed in the skies. It doesn't take a genius to know you're not supposed to carry heavy objects while gliding. I'm gonna report that idiot and make... Heavy object? The artifact? Tell me, did you see which way? Uh, I managed to catch a glimpse as I ran from the hilly churls. I think it seems like a strong lead. On oh, and don't worry. As soon as I get back, I'll tell the knights to mop up the rest of the hilly churls as soon as possible. There's no <laughs> end to this. Another chance. Uh, I don't uh, 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 this. Uh, uh, no stone unturned. Test subject. Uh, Apart from the uh, hilly churls, there's a bunch of funny looking people, too. Judging from the type of wind gliders they've got, I'd say this lot is with Raptor. But if that's the. I wonder. Well, this measly bunch can't slow us down. Whoa, look where we are. The elemental power on the artifact must have worn off. Raptor must have realized the markings would give away his position and sent his minions to slip. That way, when the effect wears off, he can make his escape. He won't get away with this. Ah. No, no se va a escapar. But we also haven't found. Forget these guys. Come on, let's keep following the elemental markings. There's only one way over there. Raptor must be up. However, it looks like the only way we could. But there's a ton of enemies below. They'll definitely attack us. If we're gonna do this, we'll have to glide and defeat them in one. You still had one stage to go in your exam. Yeah, but what's that gotta? How about we make this the third and final stage of your? Are you sure that's how the exam is supposed? It's a custom version of the exam. Does that... Besides, the normal version of the exam wouldn't be fit for the hero of Mons. So, what do you say? Prepare for takeoff. Raptor awaits you once you defeat all these enemies. Then that gliding license is yours. Dice usar los corrientes vientos cercanos para mantenerte a flote y evadir los ataques enemigos. Mientras planeas puedes lanzar bombas de rota a todos los enemigos. Ah, interesante.
aquí. Vamos por allá. Vale. No sabía que podía tirar. Bomba. Natural. I knew you'd be fine. Bye. All that's left now is to grab ourselves a raptor. Let's go. Okay. Eh, estuvo fácil, más o menos. Huh. Ah, empieza lo bueno. I'll catch up. Por ahí no. Ah, interesante abrir la puerta. Ya, 
catch up. Ignóralo, literalmente. Son unos pendejos. There's no way across. Ugh, he must be around here somewhere. Amber! Over there! If you insist on chasing me, so be it. Huh? You must be a raptor! You can't escape! <laughs> I don't need to escape. There's no way you can make it- Oh, it is pretty high. And- Oh, little girl, why don't you run along home now and let your leader deal with this? Don't worry, I promise that once the Grand Master gets here, I'll surrender immediately. <laughs> hey, watch it! You're talking to a Knights of Favonius outrider. You'll be sorry when I arrest you. Cuánta <laughs> tadie, <sighs> Amber. He's right there in front of us. <gasps> so how did he get across? Una especie más elemental, un gancho de agarre, crampon. Hmm, I don't see a mechanism, and I have. Besides, there's nowhere on the cliff that you could. Bye, bye, kid. Oh no, he's getting away. Oh, we can't hesitate any longer. The only way. But, but. Don't worry, I'm the gliding champion of Mondstadt. Remember? If. Oi, outrider! You have less chance of surviving this than jumping off the Animo God statue in Mondstadt without your. No. Paimon sees your point. If you rule out everything that's completely impossible, gliding is the only. Remember that book I lent you? The one I thought was the gliding manual, but wasn't. The first birds couldn't fly. Flight was their reward for their courage to plunge. <sighs> Be my witness. Raptor says I'll never make it. Wait! Stop! You'll never make it. Come on, off you go. Raptor says I'll never make it. But if you listen carefully. The wind. The wind says I will. Por qué presiento que hay una corri. Amber, no! You're gonna fall! You're gonna fall! <gasps> It's a wind current. She, she's gliding. Amber's gliding. You're crazy, kid. You must have known about the wind current. There's no way you would have jumped otherwise. Man, I got no the wind takes care of those who have courage. Now sit still and await your arrest, like a good little boy. Oh, 
I must leave no stone unturned. What are we doing? Just a temporary setback. All right, I got him. I only noticed the wind current from in the air, and it's the it would be suicide to try and escape in the direction Raptor was going. In other words, the only way Raptor could have gotten out would be this way, past us. Aha! So he was just trying to fool us by acting smug, in the hope that we would just give up and leave. Little did he know, we're not so easily fooled. Hmm. It was all thanks to your sharp thinking. Just like a wise man once said, once you eliminate the impossible, whatever remains, no matter how improbable, must be the truth. At the end of the day, gliding is seven parts technique, three parts instinct, and then what you did now looked more like 99 parts courage. Ah, uh, it was just like in my first gliding exam. I was super nervous, but in the end, there was nothing to be afraid of, and I passed no problem. I kind of missed that nervous rush in the exams I've done since then. It just wasn't the same. Um, sorry. Paimon thought you said you passed no problem. What do you mean exam since then? Uh, well, you see, the thing is, Mondstadt is all no glide. <sighs> Every time I get my license, it keeps getting revoked. I must, but I always pass the first time. I guess my little gliding manual ain't so bad after all. Let's go and get a copy of the real gliding manual from acting Grandmaster Jean sometime. I'll head off first because I need to escort Raptor back to the city. Once you're back in the city, don't forget to come find me at the cathedral. I'll issue your gliding... Finally. <sighs> she just can't sit still, can she? Guess that's why she's the outrider. When this is all done and dusted, let's head to the cathedral in Mondstadt. <sighs> Getting this gliding license has turned into quite the adventure. Let the wind. Congratulations! Here is your gliding license. Your official. I'm not surprised though. You are a natural after all. I'm a dumb Oh, and I'll sign you up for the next wind gliding champion. I glide so fast that no one can keep up. It's just me up there, on my own, gliding around. <sighs> it's. Oh, fighting talk. <laughs> it seems you have no idea how terrifying the champion. Well, until I kick your butt in the championship, I wish you a happy, liberating, and above all, law abiding gliding experience. Make sure you obey the rules. Whatever you do, don't get your life. Oh, brother. If you ask me, that's a bit rich coming from Amber. Hmm. Vale, con eso terminamos la primera parte de. Eh... De Amber Y espero les haya gustado chicos Yo soy me despido Y nos vemos hasta el próximo Capítulo de Amber Si han sido dos o tres No sé pues Hasta que yo lo edite Voy a saberlo Así que por último Muchas gracias por haberlo visto Y nos vemos en la próxima Chao chao